I think I need hey, some beer. Hey, new beer. beer. <laughs> right behind you. Yeah, there's only two cases there. Finish that off, you'll be doing burnouts on the deck. <laughs> <laughs> I hope so. Cheers, buddy. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah, Thanks, birthday. guys. Appreciate yeah, it. Heck of a buck. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for getting me on. <laughs> <laughs> Good shit. I tell you, the top three for the camp. I think that's your. I think it's this. Everything's coming together just <laughs> right. Just the way you want it? Yep. Holy man, there's one in my back. Well, I just wanted to kind of go over uh, what I'm wearing tonight in the blind. Um, I decided to go with uh, the new Sanctuary 2.0 jacket, uh, especially today because of this huge cold front that came in. Uh, it's definitely my go-to uh, for when the temperatures really drop, but um, I'm just going to cover like two things that I really like about this. 
Um, they've got a, a new windproof membrane in this jacket uh, that is definitely essential for being out here in North Dakota. Uh, tonight we have like 20 some mile an hour wind, so it does a pretty good job uh, of blocking that wind and keeping you warm. Another big thing is it, this jacket really is not that bulky at all. Um, I was just practicing drawing my bow back and uh, had no problem at all doing that. So, um, like I said, it's a perfect jacket to, to stay warm in uh, these cold North Dakota temperatures. Smoke City. He's gonna be toast. Go down. <laughs> He's dead right there. <laughs> wow. I don't know, but it's like negative 10 out right now, but <sighs> just a freaking beauty of a deer, man. We watched him come for price. 300 yards wondering if we were gonna have enough light when he got here worked an absolutely perfect 16 yards he's quartering to me and I was at full draw for probably I don't know it felt like a minute thought about letting up and I'm like ah, I can do this he literally last time he picked his head up he turned just enough and I put that schwacker buried it right right where I needed to and we fought, watched him fall over at like 150 yards. Night one, North Dakota, we're tagged out.
gotta work. Tagged out North Dakota, baby. Just a big body deer. Like, huge body. That's a good buck. Heck yeah. I think he just looks goofy because his body's so big. Hey, you got the corner. I do have the corner. Hey, yeah, buddy. I do have the corner spot. Holy smokes, I gotta warm my hands up. Well, here he is, December the 17th today, and couldn't be happier with this buck. It's been a whirlwind of the last 24 hours, and Goulash smashed an absolute hammer last night, and uh, we celebrated pretty good, but in the back of our heads, B was in the hospital. He had his appendix taken out tonight, and so I ended up staying with him in the hospital for pretty much all night, all this morning. Finally, at like 10 o'clock, he said, you know what, you got to go kill a buck for me. And uh, I walked out of that hospital with one goal, and I told Hunter and Goulash, I said, we got to get in that blind, and we got to kill one for B tonight. And wouldn't you know it, probably 10, 15 minutes left of light, I spot this guy out about 300 yards, and he comes in, works to 16 yards, and ended up putting a schwacker in, quartering to me, heart shot him and uh, just watched him tip over like 100 yards from the blind and I couldn't be happier. This one's for you, B. I travel with the kid all year long and uh, to see him in pain and struggling today was tough, but we fulfilled the job, we got her done, and uh, my 2021 season here in North Dakota is a wrap and uh, couldn't be happier to do it. The boys that I did tonight have all three of us in the blind capturing this. It's going to be one that hits home for a long, long time. And with that, we're going to get this bad boy back to Camp Dink and have a few bush lights.